Yeah, Shalom. Alright. Here's the book of Jude. Verse 24. Now unto him that is able to keep you from falling and to present you faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise power of a Savior be glory and majesty, dominion and power both now and ever, so be it. Giving all praises, honor, glory to the Heavenly Father and His only begotten Son, Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai Bahasham Wukar Kodash. Double honor to my teachers, the apostles, and the others, a great millstone. I shall warm to the Yakim worldwide, and are sincere and serious in doing the will of Yahweh Bahasham, Yahweh Shai Bahasham Wukar Kodash. Second Peter chapter 1, verse 1 and 2. Do you all? Yes, I'm the disciple Kosha Banyamin, a great millstone, Barbados, and now the world is forced, now the world will be forced to recognize, man. You see? The world will recognize. You understand? The world will recognize, man, that the, the Bible is the true book, man. Everything that's happening right now, who's giving you the truth? Who's telling you what's happening right now? Huh? The real men of the more side that are on the highways and highways and hedges. You understand? And as you can see, uh, also according to this truth, the Lord is telling to withdraw his hand. You understand? Because certain men such as myself cannot go on the highways and hedges because we are not curfew. You understand? So this word, you, you're gonna be forced to recognize this truth, man. You understand? The Lord's gonna make you recognize this truth, man. Right? Isaiah 34 and 16. Seek ye out of the book of the Lord Yahweh, Bahasham Yahweh Shai, and read. No one of these shall fail. None shall want her mate. For my mouth it have commanded, and his spirit it have gathered them. So none of these prophecies is going to fail, man. You understand? And by his mouth it have commanded, and his spirit it have gathered them. All these words, man, declare the end from the beginning. That we Lord said in the book of um, Isaiah 46 and 10. Declaring the end from the beginning. And from ancient times the things that are not yet done saying my counsel shall stand and i will do all my pleasure man so the lord's counsel is being performed globally man you understand it's being performed globally and a lot of you know a lot of you are forced to recognize man a lot of you are forced to recognize this truth now man you understand soon you truly get me pulled off no more internet. You understand? Then what? Huh? Then you can be letting five foolish virgins. Huh? You can be letting five foolish virgins. But help me with this here, help me with that. Any more times to help. It's survival of the fittest. It can be survival of the fittest. And the Lord said his servant is going to eat that we see it. A lot of you are. A lot of you are just there for death, man. Here's the book of um, Sirach or Ecclesiasticus in the Apocrypha, the King James Version 1611, that was taken out, that was taken out by the Bible Destruction Group, the Edomites, right? Uh, in the year 1826, you understand? So let me get the scripture you wanted there now, man. When it says, um, Sirach. Yo, hold on a minute, man. Lord willing to find the scripture, man. You right? They just saw the spirit, too. You understand? Know I woke up with this topic, Bram. You understand? Know so he come here to do it now through the spirit of the Lord, Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shah, who you ignorantly call God, Jehovah, or Jesus Christ. You understand? Damn fools when they love about the earth. Did he speak English? Huh? Did he speak English? When he spoke to the, to the apostle power language, did he speak? Huh? You all you fake pastors, you 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 TD GX, you Joe Osteen, all when the fake pastors and so-called prophetesses, when they got a lot to answer, you know, when they got a lot to answer. 
and your your the members of your congregation are gonna come after you when they are not getting the correct answers. Huh? All these smooth words and smooth doctrines, done with that. Speak the speak does see of the Lord. That's what you're supposed to do. Lord getting fed up with one of the foolish, foolish ass pastors, man. Lord says, speak dusty of the Lord, that we you see to do. But no, you won't speak smooth words. You won't, you won't be joined hand in hand with the devil. He saw Edom, he saw a call white man. Right? So like him, man. I'm trying to find the scripture when it says, when it says, um, there be many more created, but few shall be saved. Huh? So like him, my read is, man. Read the scripture, man. So, like, you bear with me, man. Trying to find the scripture, man. When it says, when it says, um, all right, let me get this one. Sirach 5 and 7. Make no tarrying to turn to the Lord and put not off from day to day. For suddenly shall the wrath of the Lord come forth, and in thy security thou shalt be destroyed and perish in the day of vengeance. So, don't waste time, man. You see what happened in the world, man? The whole world basically on lockdown. And even, 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 um, even tightened yet. You understand? But, but with this country, they're extending the curfew. You understand? So, I'm looking for it to happen here, too. Yeah, good. I'm looking for it to happen here, too. To extend the curfew. But a lot of you trust in this society. Oh, everything about the normal, the 14th of April. All the yards, this is about the normal. Do you know how much people have lost their businesses? Have lost the jobs. You understand? Do you know? Do you know how many people? Do you know how much people right now uh, um, um, are uncertain of the future because of this this so-called pandemic? Don't have to go a job tomorrow. And in other words, like if everything uh, goes back to normal, you can't hear back to normal. If they will be hired back, when things are hard already in the economy, so that was just a way for the employer to say, well, look. Alright, we can we can hold strength a little bit. Let me see how the next month go. The next month go, huh? You, you keep trusting in this society, man. Trusting your own body, your own shy, but you're gonna be forced to recognize, man. Right? I'm trying to find the scripture, man. You'll be forced to recognize, man. When it says, um, so lucky, like man. When it says, um, I know it's in Sarah. Or Ecclesiasticus, man, right? But if you get how it's worded, when it says, when it says, um, great death, great death is coming, man, right? Ah, come on, man. So like him, man. I was really trying to find that scripture, man. It's like when it says, it's it's one that says, uh, uh, um, great death is coming, be great death is coming to this world. You understand? So you seeing the beginning stages of it. It's like you seeing the beginning stages of the, of, of of um calamities, man. Daniel twelve, man. Daniel 12, right? Daniel 12 and 1, right? And at that time shall Micah stand up. The great prince will stand it for the children of thy people. And there shall be a time of trouble such as never was since there was a nation even to that same time. And at that time thy people shall be delivered every one that shall be found written in the book and not everybody is written in this book of life man i don't even know if i written in this book of life man but i given diligence man you see i given diligence man right not everyone is found written in this book of life man right so like you man 
it's so much good that coming to mind but to find it exactly you see um revelation 20 revelation 20 and um it's a lot here man it's a lot here man it's one ah uh, come on man Revelation 8 and 13 And they beheld and heard an angel flying through the midst of heaven saying with a loud voice War, war, war to the inhabitants of the earth by reason of the other voices of the trumpet of the three angels which are yet to sound So which means what? Great calamity is going to hit this earth be You understand? Great calamity is going to hit this earth be You understand? Wait till you Revelation 18 man Right? Revelation um, 18 and 1 And after these things I saw another angel come down from heaven Having great power And the earth was lighted with his glory And he cried mightily with a strong voice saying Babylon the great is fallen is fallen And has become the habitation of devils And the whole of every foul spirit And the kid of every unclean and hateful bird Right? Jumping down to verse 6. For her sins have reached unto heaven, and the more so have remembered her iniquities. So the sins of the whore, right, have reached unto heaven, man. All the atrocities that have been done in this earth have reached unto heaven, man. So what that means now is 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 great uh, uh death prepared, man. You understand? Great death is being prepared, man. Jeremiah 15. Right? So all we doing is warning you to repent that you can abide under the shadow of the Almighty. Jeremiah 15 and um, 2 And it shall come to pass if they say unto thee, Whither shall we go forth? Then shall, then shall thou then thou shalt tell them, Thus saith the Lord Yahweh, by Hashem Yahweh Shai. Such as are for death to death, and such as are for the sword to the sword, and such as are for the famine to the famine, and such as for the captivity to the captivity. Plan B. So, Lord has put a lot allotted for different uh, categories. B. You understand? To die B. And I will appoint over them four kinds of the Lord the sword to slay, and the dogs to tear, and the fowls of the heaven. And the beasts of the earth to devour and destroy. So this will get happen again, be you understand? Because what well, you didn't want to heed. Are we in the beginning stages, be? We are in the beginning stages of all these things coming to pass. You see? So make no tarrying. Because when they do a shut, ain't no more coming in. You can't yet. There ain't a key to open that door. You understand? Second Ezra 16 um, and 14. Behold, the plagues are sent and shall not return again until they come upon the earth. You hear that, man? So even more plagues can come, man. You see? Even more plagues can come. The fire is kindled and shall not be put out till it consume the foundation of the earth. What's the fire? Meaning all the different calamities that can hit this earth be that we're talking about be say Matthew 10 man hold on a minute say Matthew 10 right um Matthew 10 and 14 St. Luke chapter 12 a verse uh, 51 Suppose ye that I come to give peace on earth 
I tell you near, but rather division. Right? So like him, man, another way we want. See, Luke 12 and 49. I have come to send fire on the earth. And what will I? If it be already kindled. So more players can come and more calamities, more distress can come by this earth, man. Back in 2nd Ezra 16. Right? I'm still trying to remember the one. Did you say that? Um... Second Edwards eat and treat that way we want it, can Second Edwards try to eat, man. Then again, about the dot. Second Edwards eat, and verse start of verse one. And he answered me, saying, "The Most High have made this world for many. That way you see in this world. That's why there are many antichrists, man. That's why there are many antichrists, man. You see?" But the world to come for few. But the world to come, the powers that can come. You understand? The kingdom of heaven, but for few. Meaning what? Few that can be ruling. You understand? The rulership. Right? I will tell thee a similitude, Ezra, as when thou askest the earth, it shall say unto thee that it giveth much more whereof earthen vessels are made, but little dust that gold cometh of. Even so is a course of this present world. There be many created. But few shall be saved, boy. Few shall be saved. So a lot of death coming, man. They just begin to see this be. A lot of death coming in this world, man. You understand? So again, by the Ezra again. 16. Right? At 16, like as an arrow. Which is shot of a mighty archer, returneth not backward, even so the plagues that shall be sent upon earth shall not return again. Isaiah 55, the Lord said what his words will not return void, and he said what he's gonna bring plagues upon the world, the sword, famine, death, and destruction. Huh? Are you seeing it, man? Right? The beginning of sorrows. Salakia, so like verse 17. Woe is me. Woe is me, who will deliver me in those days? So this is what the many Lord is saying, man. Right? This is what the many Lord is saying, who can deliver me, man? You understand? The beginning of sorrows and great mornings. The beginning of famine and great death. The beginning of wars. You notice it said the beginning. Notice it said the beginning. Right? You got warships and military... Um, and uh, military personnel in Venezuela in the Caribbean as they speak. You understand? Now you got um you got um let me see if you got by this phone here. You got um a company now that you can't go to them to buy seeds. Let me see if we get right first, right? Let me see if we get correct first. You see? If in this phone is the, is the other phone here, right? But basically, there's a company that um, uh, come on, all right, gotta be the other phone, right? Is in the other phone, but basically you can't, you can't. They're, they're banning you from buying seeds, then you understand? So you can't go and buy seeds to plant food. They're banning that. You understand? The banner that be, right? And another one, um, the market is beast, the microchip is being pushed even harder. Look, I got a video here, I got a picture here, right? I don't know if you can see it good, right? So in other words, 
It says here, this man sneezed in the shop. I got his throat cut by a guy that was nearby. Luckily, he didn't die. Sad. So, this is what coming. This is just beginning. People are going to be more anxious. They're going to be more uh, um, stressed out. They're going to be more on edge. You know, son? They're going to know what to do. You know, son? Every, t every noise they hear, they're going to be ready to jump. You know, son? Ready to attack. Ready to cut your throat, as in literally, as you saw there, and figuratively, in, 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 to get ahead. You understand? Venezuela warship shoots at German cruise ship, rams it, and sinks itself. So, look, my, I just read it, right? Second Ezra 16, and eating again, the beginning of sorrows and great mornings. The beginning of famine and great death. So it really the beginning stages of food not coming plenteous, man. You understand? Huh? Just the beginning stages, B. Right? The beginning of wars and the power shall stand in fear. Who's the power that can stand in fear? These kings of the earth, man. These kings of the earth can stand in fear, man. Right, but oh shit, I didn't mean, this this thing getting real with a hand, boy. What really happening here, huh? Cause people can get riled up, man. Right. The beginning of evils. What shall I do when these evils shall come? Yeah. What what are you gonna do? You know, son. What do you many lord? Uh, um, across the world, what they gonna do? Cause the scripture says, uh, be concerned with with men like you. Don't be concerned with the on. Wait a minute, man. Don't be concerned for the ungodly, man. Let me get that, man. Huh? Don't be concerned for the ungodly. So I can't remember what This is for the elect of the children of Israel. You so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans, and you Israelite foreigners scattered amongst the 12 patriarchs, amongst the Gentiles. You're from, the, you're from what, the 12 tribes scattered among the heathen, among the Gentiles. Right? 2nd Ezra 9.13. And therefore be not, and therefore be thou not curious how the ungodly shall be punished and when, but inquire how the righteous shall be saved, whose the world is, and for whom the world is created. Like I just read, I read earlier, the world to come for few. So that's what, that's where my prayers will go to. My prayers will go to the righteous. How these brothers can make it, and what these brothers make it. You know what I mean? Y'all about Shimmy will try to protect these brothers. Shamar Kazak. These brothers be, these Akim, the apostles and the elders be. You understand? The, the, uh, uh, the, 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 the family, the household, who's allotted to be saved through them. My family, my household, who's allotted to be saved to me, if I'm, if, if you know what I mean? If that was supposed to be. But that's what, that's where my, that's where my prayers can go, man. You understand? The rest of you that they want to heed, man. Great death coming your way, man. You understand? And the Lord told you so. The Lord told you so, man. You see? Verse 14. Then answered I and said, I have said before, and now to speak. And will speak it also hereafter, that there be many more of them which perish than of them which shall be saved. Plain. So great death is coming. We just in the beginning stages. Huh? Make America great again. Holy the ass America can be great again. Use it. I mean, open your eyes, man. Look and see for yourself. Holy hell America can be great again. Huh? Like as a wave is greater than a drop. And like as a wave is greater than a drop. And he answered me. Saying, like as the field is, so is also the seed. As the flowers be, such are the colors also. Such as the workman is, such as, such also is the work. And as the husbandman is himself, so is his husbandry also. For it was the time of the world. Woo! Yeah, boy. Verse 20, right? So I considered the world, and behold, there was peril 
because of the devices that will come into it. Verse, yo, verse 21 And I saw a spirit greatly, and have kept me a grape of the cluster and a plant of a great people. So, do no, the Lord is only coming. There is some great, um, a lot, so much death is coming. The Lord's only going to grab a few grapes. You understand from off the tree? That represents the elect. You understand? Let the multitude perish then, which was born in vain. And let my grape be kept and my plant. For with great labor have we made it perfect. And that's the Lord's elect. That's the Lord's elect. That's the Lord's elect. Huh? So back in 2nd Ezra 16. Right? And 19. Behold famine and plague, tribulation and anguish are sent as scourges for amendment. So, woo! A lot of um, punishment is coming. You understand? <laughs> A lot of punishment is coming, boy. You know what I mean? And you can be you can be forced to recognize. You can look back at some of these videos. You understand? If 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 um things go back to so called normal, right? Are you able to see me go back up here on the streets now? A lot a lot of you know are gonna flock more to these these corners. You understand? Because uh, um you ain't got by your job yet to to put back on your internet, so you know we look all right. Let's go up on a Tuesday afternoon. Let me go up there and see the deer. Let's go up on a Friday night. Let me go up there and see the deer. You understand? Let's go up on a Saturday at four. Let me see the deer. You understand? That's what I'm gonna start to do. Right? Verse 21: Behold, victual shall be so good cheap upon earth that they shall take themselves to be in good case. Even then shall evils grow upon earth. So you mean even more evils coming? Lord, you mean even more evils coming? Sword, famine, and great confusion. So, victuals is goods. You know what I mean? Food, electronic devices, hardware supplies, uh, uh, um, construction equipment. You know what I mean? It can be cheap. Oh shit, boy, I can get this for that. Let me see if I can get that. But then when the Lord said, even then shall evils grow upon earth. Even then more evils. So which you people ain't gonna be you people ain't gonna repent. You know what You people ain't gonna repent. You can still want indulge in wickedness because they tell in Matthew. Because iniquity shall abound, the love of many is gonna wax cold be. You say? For many of them that dwell upon the earth shall perish of famine. And the other that escape the hunger shall the sword destroy. And the dead shall be cast out as dung, and there shall be no man to comfort them. For the earth shall be wasted, and the city shall be cast down. When they say cast down, meaning what? It's going to be destroyed. The buildings get decayed. The roads can be, can be um, um, the roads can be bad. The 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 the, the, the um, the trees sort of over over to to grow like the movie I Am Legend with Will Smith. You saw it a lot. That would mean cast down you understand there shall be no man left to till the earth and to sow it yeah to to to, to, to trim the trees you know what i mean to, to cut the grass keep the grass low you know what i mean to maintain a building here to maintain a house there you understand where they can be huh like the movie with uh, batista wait near boy i forget the movie with batista man you understand but you see basically all the city to look Desolate, my it, 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 it destroyed. You see, the tree, um, the tree shall give fruit, and who shall gather them? Huh? Who, who, who could be doing it? Who could be doing it, man? Huh? I tell you, it's a serious times. You know what I mean? And a lot of you can be forced to recognize this truth, man. You understand? Psalms one ten and three. Psalms one ten and three. Then shut shut man. Thy people shall be willing in the day of thy power, in the beauties of holiness from the womb of the morning, thou hast the Jew of thy youth. The Lord hath sworn I will not repent. 
thou art priest forever after the order of Melchizedek. So look, hey, the point is, the Lord said his word will not return void, right? So it behoove you to repent, you, you, uh, children of Israel. Isaiah 66 and 15, for behold, the Lord will come with fire and with his chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. For by fire and by his sword will the Lord Yahweh, Bahasham, Yahweh Shai, plead with all flesh and the slain of the Lord shall be many. This is a future prophecy, man. This is a future prophecy. The slain of the Lord is going to be many. So it will behoove you to repent. Repent ye for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. You so-called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. Your son, repent ye for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. You understand? Start trusting in this man's system. This man's system is going down. He wants to bring a new world order. You understand? Because he knows that he has but a short time. You even hear Bill Gates say that. He said time is not on their side. Revelation 12 and 12, Therefore rejoice ye heavens, and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil is come down unto you, having great wrath, because he knoweth that he have but a short time. And that word devil doesn't mean the mystical demon Satan coming down. He, he, he came down, he can cause havoc upon the earth. The word devil comes from the Greek word diablos, a metaphor applied to a man who by opposing the cause of God may be said to act the part of the devil or to side with him. Now who's doing that in this world? Who's pushing force uh, 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 vaccinations? You understand? You know you shouldn't be cutting your, 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 your skin. You understand? Who's pushing uh, homosexual laws? Transgender laws? Who wants to ban the Bible? Who wants to rewrite the Bible? Who has taught lies about the Bible? Who has done... Uh, um, um, cloning of animals and people you understand who's done all these things man who's put the woman above the man who has upset society who has created GMO foods you understand who's done all these things man it's like who said you can eat everything you understand who's done all these things man the so-called white man the nation of Edom you understand they are the ones that is opposing the cause of the Mosai you understand? They are the devil. They were let loose for a little season back in 14, um, 14, like late 13, 14, 15, during the Renaissance period. Then they went to Europe and whitewashed Europe with all the dark images of all people ruling. And then they slowly came up, came back into power. You understand? Christopher Columbus came over here and all the shores of the Caribbean and the States. He came with the cross. He came with all books. And slaughtered the Native Americans, man. Slaughtered them. Over 100 million Jews, right? Fled into Africa fleeing from them devils. And then, and then now later on, now, uh, uh, he, um, he wanted us up in Africa. You understand? Know slaughtered us in the triangle slave trade. You see? Over 100 million slaves' lives were lost at sea. You yeah, understand? Them is does them is who's the devil. You see? So it would behoove you to repent. It was another one you wanted to get, right? Another one you wanted to get, right? Revelation 21 Revelation 21 No, it's a lot came out, not that one Right? It's one that says um, Because you read earlier in Daniel 12, right? Uh, Revelation 20 And um I just pray, you can't wait by the here. <laughs> Revelation 20 and 12, and I saw 
the dead, small and great, stand before the power. And the books were opened, and another book was opened, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in the books, according to their words. Yeah, dead how? How many the dead were judged? You, you didn't want to repent. You understand? We were brought back to life through this word, this truth. You remain dead. We're telling Proverbs 21 and 16, right? To what the old boy Shimia will show you. Proverbs 21 and 16, right? That's who the dead man. The man that wandereth out of the way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. So you people are going to be judged, right? Um, verse 13 And the sea gave up the dead which were in it. And death and hell delivered up the dead which were in them, and they were judged every man according to their words. So this is literal now, you know what I mean? The, the, the uh, resurrection basically, you understand? And death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death, that's the missiles. You see, the ICBM missiles, right? And, um, and whosoever was not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire. Yeah, so if you even a party elect, you understand? You're going to face the judgment be of the besom of destruction, man. The besom of destruction, man. You understand? That's the ICBM missiles. You understand? And a lot of you a lot of you so called Negroes, Latinos and Native Americans, you wicked boy. You 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 you, you just got the spirit of a heathen up on you and you don't want to let go, right? So that's why great death is coming. And I ain't gonna feel sorry. I ain't, I ain't gonna feel sorry. I ain't gonna feel sorry. Even if I go before the even if I go before I see it. The Lord said that I can return though. I can return. And I come up with him and the great men that fell before me, man. You see? Once I endure to the end. But a lot of you out there that, that you you just held bent on not hearing this word. Right? Revelation, um, Revelation, where it is, man? Come on, man. Who do I know? Revelation, um, 21. And eat, but the fearful and unbelieving and the abominable and murderers and whoremongers and sorcerers and idolaters, and all liars shall have their part in a lake which burneth with fire and brimstone, which is the second death, which is what? By the ICBM missiles, the culmination of World War Three. You understand? The Lord's going to burn America. So all of you that didn't believe, man, this is your judgment. This is your judgment. You understand? She. Yeah, so I think I should shop shop there. You see? Um, yeah, boy, I think I should shop shop there. The point has been made. You can be forced to be recognized. You're going to be forced to recognize this truth, man. Right? Psalm 69 Psalm 69 Psalm 69 and um whoa Woo. oh man boy you hello hey hey you people boy hey y'all by Shimmy Shai have mercy on his elect you know what I mean you know what I mean? Because it's good to say the righteous have scarcely be saved. But for you people out there, man, that you don't want to re re return back, boy. Psalm 69, 28. Let them be blotted out of the book of the living and not be written with the righteous. But I am poor and sorrowful. Let thy salvation, O power, set me up on high. Ka halal la yahawah, ba'ashim yahushai, ba'ashim of ka'kadash. Shalom.